Hey everybody, this is Joyce Chow for MBN and News Video World. We're here with Anna Marie from La Corza. Thank you. And you happen to be the designer. I am, indeed. Thank you. And we're here at the Secret Room's Oscar Style Lounge celebrating. Oh, actually, I said the Oscar Style Lounge, right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I know. Can you tell it's towards the end of the day? And I'm looking. Every time we came over here to come talk to you guys, there were people. Yes. And it's people, true. And people, and this is like I think one of the first breaks we've seen. Yes, thank you. We've had a very energetic and lively uh, day. Incredible amount of networking and exposure. Lots of red carpet uh, nominees going down wearing our pieces. So That's we're thrilled. Always exciting. I know, oh. indeed. <laughs> And these these are absolutely gorgeous and stunning. They're, they're very organic, kind of architectural, almost living as as if you caught a, a, a caught it in jewelry. And that is definitely my inspiration and what I try to emote to the world is creating art from a nature base. So this is what I find in the desert. It is the prickly pear cactus. It's a skeleton. And from here I find a pattern or a design and then cast it into sterling silver or a rose gold and then take time to gem set them with a blue topaz or blue diamonds. No. How do you get blue topaz or blue diamond? Indeed. And the reason? Just because I like a little bit of sparkle of water in the desert. Just a... Oh, that's a good one. Oh, sparkle so, of water. Exactly. Just a drop of water in the desert. Indeed. Now these right here, these look like they should be on the walls as decoration. Thank you. And so I actually do a larger scaled version too of, of in like a yard art. But these beautiful pieces are created and inspired by Frank Lloyd Wright and organic architecture. So my uh, I can see that. Exactly. Thank you. Yes. So my great grandfather's house is the Willits House of Chicago. And so it was the first prairie house created by Frank Lloyd Wright. So there's quite a family lineage and a history that I have uh, developed a relationship with that design pattern. Well, you developed a relationship growing up. Exactly. Was it your inspiration for starting as a designer? It is, absolutely. One can't be... <laughs> <laughs> when your great-grandfather, you know, hires Frank Lloyd Wright to develop a house and build a house, that is absolutely the epitome of top design for me. It, so. it, well, Frank Lloyd Wright... I'm, yes. It's and a very good inspiration. Thank you. And that it relates back to nature, you know, and it's the architecture of nature is literally what I enjoy also. I love this for your great grand, grand your great grandfather. My great grandfather, Ward W. Willits, hired Frank Lloyd Wright to build his house. It's the Willits House in Highland Park, Chicago, and it's the first of the Prairie series. So it's an important house in architecture and design. So definitely That's infused really me cool. with with uh, inspiration. And see, now you're going to have to look it up, the Willits House, just to see what it looks like. Indeed. And then you're going to look at these pieces here. Yes. And see if you can see that in the architecture. Right, right? the relation. And the, well, and in the furniture, because he always incorporated everything together. Exactly. And my great-grandfather traveled with Frank Lloyd Wright to Japan to purchase furniture for the Willits House. So yet again, a, a synergistic, and I spent time in Japan. So it's uh, just an incredible fusion of art and nature. That is beautiful. I love, I, I love this story right here. I can sit here and delve more into it. Thank you so much. And I noticed some pieces over here. They look like flowers. So this is actually a rocky shore collection. So this is inspired from my time in Iceland. So this is a two-finger ring. And it's called the Blue Lagoon Ring. So it's, it's really ha beautifully hand-carved to create a beautiful silhouette to be worn on two fingers and features an ice blue topaz. So it's the rocky shores of the Blue Lagoon in Iceland with a beautiful ice blue topaz. Iceland. Do you have a, con a family connection? No, I don't. Just absolutely inspired by traveling. And I do work in London, so I always travel through Iceland as a passion just to be connected to nature and to regroup. And the last but not least, thank you. Lovely interview. Bravo. Let me give you the beautiful ring. Okay. These are actually created from the leaves, and they come in multiple gold and silver leaves. pull the wax up and then finally fire them and cast them and then gem set them. So amazing combinations. Very cool. Yes. It's very, very cool. These are very, these are very, very fascinating. And if people want to find
find out more about what you are designing and creating? Yes, so I have a website. It's lacorza.com, and I always try to keep everyone interested in my latest designs and blog and Facebook and Twitter. So there's quite, but I try to bring the client and the consumer into the studio so that they know my inspiration and my story so that there is a value of art that's created for the item. This is beautiful. These, you can, these are like heirloom pieces. You can make them heirloom pieces. Absolutely. I definitely have people in, you know, collecting them and they're all stamped with a metal content and all hallmarked so that it is a La Corsa piece. Well, we are enjoying them very much and I also look forward to them being in a art store like MoMA because they certainly look like they should be in there. Thank you. I would gladly accept. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate that.